guys, it's Sarah. Welcome back to the channel. I'm so happy to have you guys here and I hope that you're all doing well. Today I wanted to come on and talk about five things that are beauty related that you should always be getting from the Dollar Tree. You basically can't find them cheaper anywhere else and the convenience of getting them for a dollar is totally worth it. I've done other videos like this so I will have those linked up in the cards or in the description box below if you want to check out um, five things you should always buy, five things you should never buy. Now we're talking about five things that are beauty related that you should always get from the Dollar Tree. These videos spark a lot of conversation so if you have your own opinion and want to share it, put it in the comments down below. I would love to know what your five things are from the beauty section that you always get. If you're not subscribed to my channel, click that subscribe button, it'll be right down here or you can scroll down and click that red subscribe button. I would love to have you, it would mean the world to me to have you subscribe to my channel. So without further ado, let's get started. So number one, the first thing that you should always get from the Dollar Tree because you basically can't find it cheaper anywhere else is deodorant. At the Dollar Tree, you can get Lady Speed Stick or the men's kind, whatever your husband likes to use, and it's a dollar, it's a decent size, and it works really well. I have like sweaty pits. I know that's like TMI and super gross, but the Lady Speed Stick works really well for me, unless you need like a clinical strength, heavy duty. Lady Speed Stick compared to Dove is just about the same. Dove has like a softener in it, like a moisturizer, so it kind of like moisturizes your pits. If you have like darker underarms, it can really help with that. But if you have just like normal underarms like I do, get the Lady Speed Stick, it does the job, it has you smelling fresh compared to like the $4 Dove deodorant, which is really nice. I do love Dove, but I don't want to spend $4 for a thing of deodorant. So number two, the next thing you should always get from the Dollar Tree is hand soap. Hand soap is one of those things that I don't need luxurious hand soap. I need it to wash my hands, get the job done, and uh -uh, be done, you know? They have a bunch of different brands that I do like at the Dollar Tree. They have the soft soap and they have the Jergens. Those are two that I buy and that I like. It pays to just pick up a couple at the Dollar Tree so you'll have it for a good month or whatever. You can pick up four for $4 and you'll have it for the entire month. You can put it in your bathroom. So thing would be nail polish remover. You basically cannot find nail polish remover any cheaper unless you're buying like a big old jar of nail polish remover. But I love to get the nail polish remover there. It does the job. It gets the polish off. I just get the strong acetone one. It's a dollar and it works really good and it's just convenient to pick up one or two and you don't have to worry about running out of nail polish remover. So the fourth thing, I know this one can be a little bit controversial, so let me know in the comments down below, but I think that if you are safe and look at what you're buying, toothpaste is something that you should always be buying from the Dollar Tree. Yes, there were scares about toothpaste coming from China that had chemicals and all of this weird stuff in it, but if you pick up the box, look and see, hey, it's Crest, turn the box around, look at the ingredients, make sure it's everything that you know, you can get name brand toothpaste there that is legit for a dollar compared to three or four dollars at Walmart or Target. I much rather spend a dollar on toothpaste than have to go to Walmart or Target and get toothpaste. The most important thing is that you're looking at the ingredients and where it's made. That is something that we all should be doing. As Dollar Tree haulers, we need to be aware of what we're buying. So if you look at the back of the package, see where it's made, see where it's manufactured, see the ingredients, and see that it's a brand that's made in the USA and it's toothpaste, buy it, because it's worth it. You know, I don't think, I think that if we pulled toothpaste off the shelves at Walmart, we would have some of the same issues, but we never did, so we don't really think. We think automatically Walmart has safe products, but no company is 100% guaranteed to be safe. It's up to us, the consumers, to make sure we know what we're buying. The same thing happens at the Dollar Tree. We have to be aware of what we're buying and not just automatically think that it's the best of the best. So toothpaste is something that I buy. I like to save money on toothpaste. I buy Crest. I like the Aquafresh. Those two make me happy, they make my breath smell good, and they work good for me, so I buy my toothpaste at the Dollar Tree. Last but not least would be cotton swabs and cotton balls. You can get big things of cotton swabs, big things of cotton balls for a dollar. I would never spend more than a dollar on that kind of stuff. People, I know my friend Carol is a little bit particular about her cotton swabs. Most people, if you're like me, I just like the, um, it's like the cardboard one, not plastic. Don't ever buy the plastic cotton swabs. They suck. But if you just get like the cardboard ones, the regular standard Q-tips, they work good. They're a dollar. They have a good amount in there. They work perfect. And I don't want to spend more than a dollar on Q-tips and cotton swabs and cotton pads, cotton rounds, cotton balls, all of that kind of stuff. Any cotton material and you're using it on your face, get it there. Their cotton rounds were fine, the cotton balls were good, and the cotton swabs were perfect. Because I use them for more than just cleaning out your ears, you know, getting your makeup off and all of that kind of stuff. 
they work perfect and they're a dollar and they're compared to this price right here so I know it's gonna be a bit of a deal but it's like when you go to the Dollar Tree you pick up these things they're standard things that you always pick up and you can always save money if you are a couponer take that coupon with you to the Dollar Tree see if they have that brand and save money there I know for a fact that you can get coupons for the toothpaste and basically get free toothpaste so those are my five beauty health related things that you should always be buying from the Dollar Tree so that you're saving money when you go pick up these things and you don't ever have to worry about running out and getting overcharged at Walmart or Target let me know what your five things are put them in the comments down below thank you so much for watching guys I hope that you enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up I love you guys so very much I hope that you're having an amazing day and I will see you guys next time bye guys